Freshman will take the PK. She oh, got it. And she she it. Yeah, she does. Congrats to the Rainbow Ahine. UH freshman Nalani Demacian scored on a penalty kick, lifting Hawaii to a 2-1 victory over UC Davis. Demacian now has four goals this year. All four have been game winners. Clutch! The Wahine host uh, Hawaii Pacific Sunday afternoon, 4 o'clock at the YPO Soccer Complex. All right. We thought we were tuning in to watch Shohei Otani inch a little closer to that 50-50 mark. 50 home runs, 50 steals, something no one has ever done before. What we didn't know is that we were going to witness one of the great performances all time. Take a look. Otani sends it on the air. Yeah, and that's only part of it. Otani went six for six from the plate. He had three home runs. Uh, he ended up uh, driving in 10 runs altogether. Shohei became the first player ever to hit three homers and steal two bases in a single game. But wait, there's more. The Dodgers' 20-4 victory clinched a postseason berth, the first of Otani's career. Speaking through an interpreter, Otani said after the game, quote, I have no idea where this came from, but I'm glad that I performed well today. Well. Talk about an understatement. And honestly, who knows where this goes? To Guy's point earlier, Shohei has 51 homers and 51 steals with nine more games in the regular season. And if you, that, and yeah, and if you count postseason, it's going to be incredible. All right, two Hawaii football greats, teammates at St. Louis, and both former NFL stars will watch their sons now battle each other tonight. Olin Krutz and Dominic Raiola grew up in East Honolulu. Both were part of the Crusaders dynasty back in the 1990s, and both were dominant offensive linemen in the NFL, NFL's NFC North. Today, their sons will square off when Nebraska faces Illinois. Krutz has two sons with the Fighting Illini, linebacker James and offensive lineman Josh. They're going to face Dylan Raiola, the star quarterback at Nebraska. It's pretty surreal to know that they're going to be facing off against each other. After the game, still family, still hanging out, still talking story. We've been talking story through this whole week. Yep, Nebraska and Illinois both undefeated, both nationally ranked. They're going to meet at 2 p.m. Hawaii time. Big weekend for the Rainbow Wahine volleyball team. They face eighth-ranked Texas in Austin tonight. The Longhorns are two-time defending champs. They boast three Hawaii girls. They, they recruit a lot here in the islands. Uh, Rela Bini, Keone Leakana, and Devin Kahahabai. Uh, tomorrow, they're in Waco to face 20th-ranked Baylor. By the way, Hawaii's Kaylin Alexander, now number one in the nation in total kills. She has 191 so far after she put down 23 against UNLV. It's going to be a big test, but going to be fun to watch there, guy. Yeah, it's going to be good fun to watch. They'll have a good time in Austin, too. Yeesh.